This video contains or may contain spoilers for Hollow Knight. One very fun thing about Hollow Knight is playing around with the various fan-made mods available. As people have played the game with these mods, they've wondered how such mods could actually make sense given the lore of the game. In this video, I thought I'd try my hand at explaining a few of them, just like I explained how game mechanics tie in with the lore in one of my previous videos. For one, there's the Enemy Randomizer mod. All the enemies of Hollow Knight fit into the area in which they're found, but this mod, of course, has them all mixed up. I think the simple explanation for that is that the infection caused the husks to wander far away from their homes. It happened with Sly and Bretta when they were partially infected, so it definitely makes sense with fully infected husks. A similar mod is the Pantheon Randomizer. I think the explanation for this one is that the Godseeker wants to test the knight by making it so that they never know which boss battle is coming next. There's also the Room Randomizer mod. The Item Randomizer mod makes sense, as certain items just happen to be in different locations than in the normal game, but Room Randomizer is very different. The best explanation I can come up with is that the Radiance, in an attempt to stop the night, put portals at the entrance and exit of every room that leads somewhere completely different from where they would normally connect to. If she was powerful enough to bring the infection back even while sealed away, she could probably do something like this too. She's a higher being, damn it. Another one is the Hollow Point mod, also called the Gun mod, for obvious reasons. As for why the knight has a gun, they could have picked it up when they were outside Hollow Nest. That's probably how they got their nail in canon, after all. As for why no one else in Hollow Nest has guns, they probably hadn't been invented or allowed in there, and the bug that the knight got theirs from came from elsewhere. This other place would be at a different level of technological development than Hollow Nest, such that they would have firearms. There are also the Bench Warp and Debug mods. I think the explanations for these are that in this particular timeline or universe, the Knight just has some extra abilities that they inherited from their higher being parents, such as the ability to become intangible at will, that is, no clipping, or to teleport to certain locations. Something similar could also explain mods like Enemy HP Bar and Show Enemy Hitbox. The Knight inherited some Worm Foresight abilities from the Pale King, and so they can always see how close an enemy is to defeat or where exactly the enemy can be hit. Obviously, there are dozens and dozens of Hollow Knight mods, and I wasn't going to try to cover all of them. These were just some that seemed to need the most explanation for how they could line up with the lore. Were there any other mods that you think I could have mentioned? How would you explain them? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. Please be sure to give it a like, share it, Check out my other Hollow Knight videos, and subscribe to my channel for more. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you next time.